window while your son don't need the gun to get respect from What's up guys? Grantly16 here once again playing Clash Royale. Uh, we're on my small account. As you can see, we are 1,725 trophies still at level 3. I'm 98 out of 100 on level 3, but I'm trying not to request anything, trying not to upgrade anything. Uh, so this is basically the deck I have. I could upgrade almost everything in here. There's just three cards that uh, I couldn't upgrade, but I could upgrade most of this stuff. Uh, but I'm trying to keep it as low as possible. I can't get any more XP or else I will uh, level up, of course. And I want to get as high as I can being this level 3. I don't want to uh, try to upgrade anymore. I'm going to see if maybe I can get to Frozen Peak as a level 3 before I go to the level 4 transition. Uh, but we've been facing a lot of level 6s, 7s, sometimes 8s. Uh, it's really crazy. Here, Here's a level 6. Right off the bat, General Kip. Go ahead and do a sad face right off the bat because he has a significant uh, level advantage on me. And we'll see what we can do with this real quick. Okay, so he's got the Valkyrie Musketeer. I'll just go with this. And uh, I can throw the Giant out there as kind of like a distraction. <clears throat> And the, the Musketeer will just turn around and shoot those. And I can do this. I'm having to over-defend on a lot of these. Simply because their cards kill my cards like crazy. Like, my cards stand no chance. Like, my level 2 Musketeer obviously is going to lose big time to that uh, level 5 Musketeer. So, I've got to be really careful. i got to play really smart. You see... I had to stop that mini Pekka with a tombstone, a last second tombstone, and uh, so we're doing, we're not doing bad. Uh, he does got us down to 948, but you got to keep in mind that my tower only has like, I think 14 or 1500. So uh, we're gonna do uh, a push real quick. Hang on, let me go ahead and throw this off to the side, kind of distract these, and it'll distract it just long enough, and we can arrow this down. Yep. Okay, they're going to get some damage there. That's okay, though. What we're going to do is uh, take a tower real quick. <laughs> okay, giant, balloon, and good luck uh, stopping that. <laughs> giant balloon at the bridge. Now, that's something you don't always see. Okay, and uh, we successfully stopped their uh, little goblin push there. We can throw the musketeer out here in the middle. Uh-oh, that goblin barrel might actually take my tower here. No, not quite. So we got 48 seconds left. We can, uh, we can throw a witch out to kind of help out in defense. We can throw this out. Let the tower eat on that P.E.K.K.A. Throw this out to be a distraction. I just need to kill that Valkyrie. Okay, there's the witch. It's a level two witch. So let's throw this out. Uh-oh. There goes a the tower. Oh no, they got the tower. That's okay though. We'll just distract this for just a moment. It's hard to stop all these. It's very hard to stop all these. Okay, so we got the uh, that coming back to us. We can throw this down, kind of help defend. Maybe we can stop this. One more uh, giant balloon should do it, I think. Okay, so here we go. Giant, and then, wait for it, balloon. We're gonna arrow this down so the giant doesn't die quite as fast. We're gonna do this. <clears throat> okay, we're getting some pretty good damage. We got some pretty good damage there, so that's not bad, not bad at all. Um, we can do this. I want to stop this witch. I need to stop this Valkyrie over here, so I'm going to do a giant. I need to do this to hold that pick off for just a second longer. Okay, now, we, now we're going. We could at least tie with them. So that's not... I accept the tie very willfully in this, uh, in this state, because... 
I, I'm, I've got such a low account that uh, it's hard for me to, to keep up. Anyway, he almost had us there. He got us down to 600. But we ended up defending very well, I thought. Uh, didn't If we would have defended that Goblin Barrel one more time, we might have almost had it. So let's go again. All right, let's jump right into another match and uh, see what we can do. We're facing these high levels. This is a level 7 we're about to go up against. Sad face to start it off. Johnny Brake. Okay, so that's gonna, this is going to be... He's coming in with a Raged Hog Rider, which was a pretty a pretty uh, good attack because uh, his level is so high that I, I can't stop it, you know. So he's going to let that knight come on in, I guess. Oh, he, there's another knight, a level 7 knight. I'm going to do a Balloon Giant on this side to see if he can stop it. I'm hopefully going to get this Skeleton Army off before this knight reaches the tower... No, not quite. But we're doing some major work to this tower over here. Look, we got him below what he got us. And we're going to have to pretty much cross map this uh, witch. There we go. And it's going to turn to the wizard. There we go. And the musketeer stays alive so it can take care of the hog. And that's, that's a hog. And we just need one more Balloon Giant, and I think we can take this tower. It's going to be one shot by his tower. Uh, this this is going to be pretty difficult for me to stop. <clears throat> and he's going to rage it, so it's definitely going to take the tower. Okay, let's save up for our Balloon Push, our Balloon Giant Push. He's going to have to throw out something to stop that. Okay, so which should pretty much stop everything right there and the knight's going to take the blunt of the damage there so i don't know it may not stop it my witch might kill his yeah okay and we got a giant we got a balloon now we're coming in he's coming in with the prince though so he's going for the three crown on me that did a lot of damage that initial hit there but we uh we redirected his prince now we're going for the three crown on our side yeah, there we go. We got his tower down below uh, what he got ours, so that's always a good sign. Uh, we can throw this witch out. We can throw this prince out. I don't want him to get too much damage on me here. Whoa, double whiz. Wow. He's trying hard. He's trying so hard. Can my musketeer stop that? Jesus Christ. <clears throat> okay, balloon. Do your worst. Do your worst, balloon. You got it, balloon! Get it! Yeah! Oh, no! Oh my god! 25 health gate. Okay, we're gonna get right into another battle. Okay, level four. Level four. This level, he must be pretty good. He, he must know what he's doing exactly. He, he's still gonna have a little bit higher level cards than I have, but uh, it's, it's gonna be pretty interesting to see what this guy can do with uh, whatever combo he's using. So he's gonna be. Uh, he should be pretty difficult, I imagine. Okay, he's just going to use the rocket, which, uh, just using the rocket by itself, it gives me freedom to throw, uh, a couple cards out here. He gave me a free tombstone. Now he's giving me a free witch behind the, uh, the giant. And the witch is going to take care of those skeletons. The balloon's going to come on in. Inferno Tower is up, but that really doesn't make too much of a difference because I got a witch hitting the tower and his witch. And that's a, that's a immediate tower. And uh, I kill his witch in the process, so the Inferno does pretty much no good. Uh, he waited a pretty long time for that. Uh, we'll wait and see what happens here. Knight in the back. Okay, so we know he has Inferno. we got to be really careful of that. I'm glad that we got an early lead, though. We got the Tombstone just in case. We got uh, the Skeleton Army to stop this. And we're going to need to put the tombstone out. Oh, it didn't draw it back! Dang! Okay. 
He got a lot of damage off that one balloon. <clears throat> because I tried to put the tombstone, but I put it one tile too far. And it caused me to get a lot of damage on that tower there. Okay, so these skeletons are coming in. This may do a pretty significant amount of damage. Yeah. Look at that. That We're melting that tower. Just melting it down here. Uh, we got it down to 620. Alright, so hopefully he doesn't have anything to put in front of this uh, witch. There we go. We'll bring the... We'll bring that over. Okay. So we don't have much here. <clears throat> he's playing smart. You know, he's coming back on me. And uh, I don't really have a whole lot I can do about it. See, he just took that tower. So we'll just go giant balloon really quickly. And he's going to try to take the secondary tower also. <clears throat> but it's uh, it's not going to work too well. I'm going to take that tower. And now we can put our witch down. You know he's going to try to balloon. If my balloon gets one more hit, it's going to dominate. It might take that tower. I might can just arrow it down once this hits. Or it can just take it and we can three crown. That's what I'm talking about. That was a level four. But he was a pretty skilled level four. Uh, you don't usually see that too much. So we're moving right back up. We, we were at 1725. We lost uh, one or two. And so now we're at 1681. Not bad. Uh, level six. Sad face. We're going to see what we can do here. We have the giant balloon right off the bat. Like uh, like I said before, though, I don't want to commit too much right off the bat. Look at there. He's got a P.E.K.K.A. coming in. I'm going to force him to defend this uh, giant balloon. There we go. He defends it uh, pretty well. We can put a tombstone on this side. And that should pretty much take care of that P.E.K.K.A. We can arrow this down. There we go. Uh, hopefully we can get our skeleton army up before he kills everything. Okay. There we go. The Pekka's taken care of. He's got Pekka Balloon, which is an impressive match. Uh, I don't know if you guys seen it in my earlier episodes, but that was one of the decks I used when I was coming up uh, around the 4,000 mark. It was the ultimate deck video. So it's, a, it's actually a really, really good deck. Okay, <clears throat> so we pretty much just stop that prince with just the witch, and we can uh, we can just throw this knight out to take some of the damage from the skeletons. I'm hoping this tower can keep up with all this. Wow. Okay. So we got to be careful here. We're gonna drop the giant balloon again. This time we're gonna have the arrows on standby. Okay, giant balloon. Uh-oh. They're focused on the giant right now, so that's a good thing. Wow! Why did they redirect to the balloon? I don't understand that. Oh, well. Uh, we'll bring that balloon this way. Let the Both towers are focusing on it. And they kill it before it reaches the tower, so that's good. It's still, it's still going to get the death damage, but we're doing good. Okay. There's arrows to take care of the majority of the skeletons, but I'm hoping this can kill it. Okay, there we go. And which to stop the rest of these skeletons. Which my towers might have could have taken them out, but I, I didn't want to risk it. Alright, so we got witch and we got this, and we'll hold it off with this. A lot of defense coming. He just used his primary defense against my balloon giant. So you know what that means. That's instant attack. That's what that means. And if he can cycle back to those, I'll have his number. If he can cycle back to that minion horde. Boom. Got him. And now we can bring the balloon over here. And hopefully we can take it out before it reaches the tower. There we go. All right. Now, we, now we've got some damage going. Uh, we can do this. Uh-oh. There's something I didn't want to see. Fire spirits. Okay, so we got the witch, and that's going to be able to stop that pretty easily. Now, all we have to do is balloon giant one more time, and I think we'll have it. We got the perfect setup. Look, he's going to P.E.K.K.A. 
But that was a lot of elixir. He's not going to have enough for the minion horde. Oh, yeah, he did, actually. Wow. But I'm going to arrow it down. Now, what does he have to stop it? He doesn't have anything to stop it, and that's going to end the game, I think. Boom! There it is. Another three crown. Uh, this time, it was on a way higher level guy than me, and we dominated him. <laughs> okay. I think we'll play one more. And we'll uh, go ahead and end the video. Going right into another battle. Uh, this time against the level 5. We'll see what happens. So, <clears throat> we need to start off really cautiously. 9 in the back. What's he going to put out? Okay, Valkyrie. We'll counter that with a Musketeer. Okay, and he's going to put a Tombstone. So that's going to pretty much kill that. And we save the Musketeer, but just barely. The Knight's still coming in. He didn't defend that Knight, so it's going to sneak a little damage in. We, we're now ahead of him in damage, even though he's a higher level. Okay, so Baby Dragon. That's going to be defended by a Witch. And then it's going to assist my Knight in taking out this Hall Rider. So now, uh, we're pretty close to even here. I'm glad that knight ran in front of that witch. So now, uh, the witch can kind of stand back, help take out this Valkyrie. And we'll see what we can do here. I think my tower will kill that, so we'll go giant balloon on this side. Everybody defends with a skeleton army. Keep that in mind. That is the number one defense on low levels, skeleton army. We may take this tower though. Yep, it's gonna take the tower. Boom, there we go. Musketeer to save the day here. And I know he's got mini P.E.K.K.A. so that could easily take a tower very quickly. We have to be really careful about that. Uh, so, I've got my skeletons on standby. Uh, looks like his main attack's gonna be the Valkyrie. Uh, Pekka, so I'm gonna have to throw something out for the Valkyrie, something out for the Pekka. Okay, we'll start a knight in the back on this side. Uh oh, he's coming, coming in hard with that. He zapped it. That's okay. We still got some skeletons, and we got the witch. We got arrows for that. We've got a musketeer for that, and we may get some damage on this tower now. Nope, he's got a Valkyrie to stop me. We're going to start the Knight in the back. We know what he's going to do here. We already know. So Witch for extra precaution. Because you know he's thinking about throwing that P.E.K.K.A. out. There's that P.E.K.K.A. I was waiting on him. <clears throat> Might have to let that hog kind of play out. I'm glad that my uh, Musketeer is able to take that out. So now we can do Giant. That'll focus on the Giant. Then we'll do this. And that's a good game. Good game. Well played. Good luck. Thumbs up to end the game against that level 5. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. Okay, so we're, we're at 1688. We didn't do the best uh, today, but... I'm going to try my hardest to keep pushing on that, and we'll see what we end up in the future. I hope you guys enjoyed looking at the small account. If you want to see uh, some more gameplay for my small account, just go back. Uh, request it if you want. Uh, I don't really have a lot of people requesting uh, much gameplay from this small account. So uh, if you guys don't like it, you, you know you can tell me, and I just I, I won't do it. But uh, I like to just go through every once in a while and uh, see if I can beat some players that are almost twice my level uh, with this small account. Anyways, guys, you take it easy.